Hello everybody, I'm GG and welcome back to this tutorial series and in today's episode we're going to take a closer look at the config paths. We're inside the plugin of our last episode, the player join event of the config episode and what I would like to edit because now you can see the this is not going to work if you want to have multiple values for one player like if uh, this is how many times a player joined and if I want to store money, I would have go need to do like money and it will be very disorganized. And there's a little trick in which you just separate like the values. So you have got Greyhunt 99 as the as the parent and then as a child you got money. And that's what we're going to do in today's episode. So let's go to play join. And before we do the, anything uh, we are gonna edit this because the player name should be taken before we do anything with it so over here we do player name player name and since we want to uh, separate this we want to remove the value and the the custom path separator the, the default path separator you can change that in the options over here uh, like I get config dot options if you do not like the dot dot path separator you can change it over here to uh, whatever you want uh, but I will just leave it on the default the, the dot and if you take a look inside over here all you need to do is we need to add a little uh, thing to it as I explained the uh, plus like sticks the two strings together and then we do the path separator so from now on we just have player name so this is the player name and then if we do a dot we go into the player name so we go in like a little indent over there and what I would like to do is type in joint over here and then we should change it over here so in joint player name uh, you can just do uh, over here plus dot joint and over here as well plus dot joint like that and if we start up the server now we're gonna get joint over here but what I would like to do is also store money so now we only have one uh, value because this value is gonna get removed and it's gonna be over here so joint and that's gonna be two like that and next to it we want to store money to do so we need to uh, take a look at this again because over here we create our variables so we're gonna copy that control V and instead of joint we're gonna change it to money money so now there will be joint and there will be money over here I'm gonna remove this in a second so that you can see uh, how it works and uh, because we also want to uh, save then we save the config and we know how much money a player has by just typing in int money eagles plugin dot get int dot get config I'm sorry get config dot get int and then do player name plus dot money that's how you uh, do uh, the paths so that's how you create a, a neat little organized config the YML and let's go take a look because that's it for the coding for today it's that easy you can change the the default paths uh, separator over here in the options I don't recommend it because the dot is kind of useful and yeah let's go take a look to inside Minecraft now I've started up the server and let's go take a look so if I join once it should be generated so that I joined once I'm gonna join twice just so you can see the difference I've now joined twice and let's now take a look at the config file so this is how the config file looks now it's uh, the main thing my player name then there's the child joined and the other child value money and as you can see joint is 2 and money is 0 
and that's it for today's video thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video leave a like if you want to see more subscribe any feedback or suggestions down below in the comments or join our discord and see you next time